one satellite dish. This is a zone two satellite dish, by the way. So it's bigger, obviously, than the zone one. I believe it's 80 centimeter. Oh, it has got a bit of a dent in it. Ah, oh, there you go, it's pushed back. We are last in music. So in this kit then. Bit of instructions. That's for your cable to go through when it goes through the wall in your house, so I don't need to worry about that. Fixing bolts and screws, 4F connectors and some tie wraps just to keep tied of the cables up with. <coughs> in here, quad LMB, which is four feeds, and all the associated Holes don't need to pull. Can you get naughty straight to the wall? And our box of gubbins. Oh. One, two, three, four, you bets. Right there for the, the black ones are for the dish to so that there two wire points, two wire points. Oh. Lines up with the holes there. So what we'll do is turn it that way up, <clears throat> tighten everything up later, but I'll just assemble it for now. Right, it looks like that's a little bit off. We'll just manipulate it to place. Just squeeze that together. God, it's bloody boiling. Right, with this, so this takes a Mark IV quad LMB. So that part there is where the LMB fixes onto, where the lug is. The other part goes into there, like that. And it fixes with a bolt through there, which it should be just one of those long ones, I believe. screws with the square neck so what I do I put them on the inside because that's where the square neck is and it locks it then you can adjust these accordingly So 
know these dishes point approximately south if you look at the charts for the dishes these astra satellites what these pick up are at 28 approximately 28 degrees i think it's 28.3 or something like that south so if you imagine south being 180 degrees if you subtract 28 off that leaves 158 degrees doesn't it uh, sorry 152 degrees so if you point if you've got a bear in a compass whatever you can approximately line it up and then try and find tuning it yourself i've got a device i can connect onto the lmb which will tell me when i've got it aligned which is uh all good Oh, so that's the square ones again and Alright, well, I've put the first part of the bracket on, one, two, three, four, and I've put this tube going downwards. Well, so we can mess with that wire there and align with the dish. You can also see that the U-bolts go up and the nuts are on the top and get to them easily. So there you go, that's nice and solid now. So now it's a case of mounting the dish. So here's the quad LMB. So that looks like it's already rotated to the right angle anyway. But you've got a little bubble there. Just to check when you put it on the arm. You've also got your 4F connectors there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to terminate the F connectors, connect them to this and then push the LMB onto the arm of the dish. All right, this actual case in here, this actually slides down to cover the F connectors. So here's my little test meter. So it's got an F connector on the top there on off switch but if it's come on and then what we'll do is select it to it should be on 28.3 as the default make sure it all works so i just click to sat so i can do with this but anyway so that's on i don't know if you can see that that's on 28.3 so what i'll do is i can get a signal strength indicator and that once i connect this up and i'll be able to Basically, see what's on the channel, what's showing. Well, I don't believe that. I've not even lined it up, and there it is. It's lined up straight away. Yeah, uh, I can't see what the signal strength is, but I should be able to go down the channels. Um, God, it's ages since I've worked this. There we go. Go for the channels. Drama. So what I'll do is I'll just see if I can find the signal strength. 